Hello, I'm Vary and Brandon, and this is the first of 11 videos that accompany the kit for this coat. This is the Arion coat. And if you are here because you've gotten the kit, then hi, I'm here. I'm going to be answering all your questions. Um, hopefully in these videos, what I'm going to be doing is taking um, a smaller scale version of the coat, bigger needles, bigger yarn, smaller scale, not the same charts, but all the techniques are the same. So that I will start out by telling you what we're going, what part of the construction we're going to cover in that video, take you to a different camera where we look at um, the the little the smaller technique sample, and then come back and talk about it again. So it's, it'd be like a knit along because at the um, end of every episode, I'm going to tell you what you need to have done for the next episode, and at the beginning of every episode, I'm going to tell you what you should have had done for that episode, and then as I said at the end, we'll tell you what you need to have done for the next episode. Um, if you are here because you just looked at, you saw this one or what this was about, or you've seen me talk about this coat because I've been talking about it for a while, and you're wondering, well, I don't know, can I do this? I don't know. Um, you certainly can do this. This is not difficult at all. It's a lot of knitting, you know, it's a lot of knitting because it's a big coat. Or you can do a shorter version. There are three different links uh, in the version, in the coat, in the pattern. What am I trying to say? In the pattern. There are three different links in the pattern. And um, so you can do it all just depending on how much you want to, you know, how much, you know, want a knitting. I mean, some people like pro projects, so, but it's not difficult. So watch a couple of videos, watch and see what happens and, or watch all of them. And you go, when you get to the end of it, then go get yourself a kit because this is fun to do. Um, you can get your kits at www.elementalfx.com and Jean DeCoster and I, who is the, she's the dyer over at Elemental Effects. Um, she's on the West Coast. I'm on the East Coast. This is sort of a cross-country, transit, transcontinental, whatever. <laughs> Sounds like I should end up with a spike in Utah, doesn't it? I'm sorry. Um, anyway, this is a transcontinental pattern <laughs> project. So, um, but she has got gorgeous yarn. If you are familiar with working with Shetland yarn, this, her yarn is, um, this is, this is a skein of a, her yarn from a different project. Um, this is Elemental Effects. You can see that there. And then it's her, um, where you go, Shetland fingering. And it comes in 60 colors. I think that's right, if not close to that. Um, they're gorgeous colors. Here's the here is the bottom of this. Um, all these colors. You see, she comes in all these gorgeous colors and more. That's just nine of them. All these beautiful colors. My little model here keeps trying to spin around the little dance. You see, it's a little scary sometimes watching it move by itself. Sorry. Anyway, I digress. I'm so sorry. <laughs> anyway, um, her yarn. I mean, I need to get serious here because her yarn is gorgeous. I don't know what she does to it, but it knits like Shetland. It's the Shetland sheep raised in North America or raised in America, raised in the United States, Montana, Colorado. Um, and, but she does something extra to it that causes it to kind of bloom when you wet block it. It is amazing to work with. And it's even more amazing after you wet block it. I mean, this is a beautifully drapey. It's just lovely. Um, so that's Elemental Effects Shetland Fingering, which is what this is made out of. I do a lot of work with her, and that this, this skein here is from another project because I've worked, worked with her yarn a lot. Um, but if you, um, as I said, if you want to get the pattern, it's ElementalEffects.com. Um, join us for the rest of the videos. There are 10 more in which I actually go into the construction of this. Uh, if you want the kit, the kit is, um, you'll you get access to um, asking me questions, discussion group. We have a discussion group up on Yahoo. We have, um, you'll get all the yarn, the pattern. We'll even, we've even thrown in an extra um, hat pattern um, for the hat pattern that goes with this, this project using some of the same uh, charts. Uh, so it's a, it's a great deal for all of all the stuff that you get. So I'm here for you. If you've got any questions, if you're working on it, if you've got any questions, get back in touch with me or get up going up to the Yahoo Yahoo group. The Yahoo group is called Knitting the Aaron Coat. So um, I mean I figured let's see how it is. Knitting the Aryan Aryan Coat. That's A-E-R-I-O N as you saw from the beginning. So thank you so much for joining me. I'm Gary and Brandon. This is the Aryan Coat. The arm is elemental effects of Shetland. Shetland fingering, and I will hope to see you on knitting the coat and 
join me